What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to verify your PC specs on Windows using the system information tool. When it comes to checking the specifications of your Windows computer, the system information tool is one of the most comprehensive ways to do it. It provides detailed information about your processor, memory, graphics cards and other hardware components all in one place. First, search for system information in your start menu and hit enter. Once the system information window is open, you will see a summary of your computer specs right on the main screen. Here's a breakdown of the key information you'll find. First, you'll find details about your operating system, including which version of Windows you're using. This is useful for knowing if your system is up to date and compatible with specific programs or games. Next, you see the type of processor your computer is using. The program will display the make and model, like Intel Core i7 or AMD Ryzen 5 as well as its clock speed. This is important because your processor is essentially the brain of your computer and knowing the exact model helps you understand its performance capabilities. Further down, you will find how much memory or RAM is installed in your system. This is crucial for multitasking and running programs smoothly. The amount of RAM will give you an idea of how much memory is available for your system to handle multiple applications at once. Now, if you want more detailed information about specific components, like your graphics card or storage drives, you will need to explore a bit more in the system information tool. To find out what graphics card your computer is using, you will need to expand the component section on the left hand side of the window. Click the small plus sign next to components to open the subcategories. From there, scroll down and select display. Here, you will see detailed information about your graphics card. For example, you might see something like NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1650 or Intel UHD graphics, depending on what hardware your system has. This information is crucial if you are into gaming, video editing or any graphic intensive tasks, as it lets you know how well your computer can handle such processes. To check your storage, follow a similar process. Again, under the components section, look for storage and click the plus to expand it. You can select disks to view the physical hard drives or SSDs installed on your computer. You will see details like the type of drive, total capacity and how much space is currently available. This is especially helpful if you're running out of space and considering upgrading or cleaning up files. In addition to these core components, the system information tool provides a lot of other data that may be useful for diagnosing issues or upgrading your system. You can check out details about your network adapter under components and the network or dive into the sound device section to see what audio hardware is installed on in your PC. If you ever need to share your system specs with someone, maybe for troubleshooting or technical support, you can export all this data. In the system information window, simply click on file in the top left corner and then select export. You'll be able to save a text file containing all the information we've just covered, which you can easily send to someone else. That's it. The system information tool is a powerful way to get detailed insights into your computer's hardware and it's easy to use. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.